All right, hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Species Artificial Life Real Evolution. And today, we're gonna create some of the most popular creatures in pop culture. We're gonna create some Pokemon boys, and we're gonna submit them to radiation, and we're gonna evolve them in a realistic way. So what would Pokemon actually look like if they were submitted to real evolution? After all, this is a realistic evolution simulator, so so we're gonna see what Pokemon evolutions actually look like. And I have a good roster of Pokemon here that I wanna try. First of all, we're gonna start with one of these guys. Let's say this guy right here, which is rather big compared to his little bodies over here. I can't believe you've done this. He's a rather thick boy. So this is our base creature right here, and we're gonna try to create a Pokemon out of this. I want you guys to try to guess what Pokemon this is gonna be. So this is gonna be a rather simple Pokemon. Pokemon here. I want you guys to try to guess what Pokemon I'm trying to create here. We're gonna start with basic Pokemons, all right? So first, we're gonna change the saturation here, and we're gonna go with this color right there. I, I want you guys to try to guess what Pokemon this is. Who's that Pokemon? It's Pikachu! Bye! Now this guy is gonna breathe air, so this is gonna be positive here. That means he lives on land, and He's gonna eat only plant. So we're gonna change this to negative. <laughs> it's a caterpie. <laughs> At least it's trying to be. And we're gonna evolve this little dude and see what an actual caterpie evolution looks like. It's not gonna be a butterfly, I'll tell you that much. Now, caterpies definitely don't have um, limbs, but they do have kind of like a kind of like a tail, I guess. You could say that. They don't look anything like that. Maybe when they're attacking, they do this, but. Other than that, it's not really like this at all. And I think that's gonna be it. All right, so this is gonna be Caterpie right there. Caterpie, there you go. Let's export this one, there you go. And we're gonna splice this little dude over here with a Caterpie DNA. So that's gonna be our first Pokemon right there. All right, so here we have another section of the map with other creatures. And guess what Pokemon I'm gonna create here? I want you guys to guess. We're gonna go over here, and this is also gonna be a very simple Pokemon. You know, it's a smaller one, so let's reduce this the shape here a little bit. Let's let's go with this one right here. That's gonna be the torso rotation. There you go. Wow! Now we're gonna change the skin. All right, the skin must change here. All right, I think that's a good color. All right, are you guys guessing what this is gonna be? <laughs> and this actually, this is actually perfect right here. So we're gonna change the head size. They don't have any limbs, all right? I think this is perfect. All right, what Pokemon is this? <laughs> That's a diglet, my dudes, all right? And uh, hopefully when they evolve, they just grow another pair <laughs> of diglets, I mean, right? and uh, they just walk together. I think that's the evolution of a Diglett, right? Now, I'm not gonna go into the discussion of what this is. To me, it's a mouth. It's always been a mouth, so I don't really care, all right? All right, this is a Diglett, and we're gonna evolve this guy and see what happens. Now, these guys already have an interesting shape, but we're gonna create an iconic Pokemon right here. Very well-known Pokemon, all right? Let's change the size here. It's gonna be about 1.5. Or something like that. We're gonna change the skin here. It's not gonna be perfect, but I'm gonna try. <laughs> I'm gonna try my best, guys. Oh my god! I bet you guys know where I'm going with this, right? <laughs> All right, something like this, I would say. Mm -hmm. Oh, I think maybe this one right here. Oh, that's that's not too bad. I don't like the face though. Uh, I think this one would be okay, right? It seems like this creature would be in pain if I do this, so... <laughs> Let's try to find a Pikachu head here. I mean, does this look like a surprise Pikachu to you? I don't think so, right? That's the only surprise Pikachu that I can create in this game. I'm sorry. I promised you something and this is the best that I can do. <laughs> I'm ashamed of myself. All right. It's looking... Uh, it's looking okay. Don't worry about it. Just don't overthink it, all right? This is Pikachu right there. All right, I'm sorry. That's the best tail I could find, all right? That is the best tail I could find. <laughs> all right, let's create Pikachu then. And we're gonna splice these guys with that DNA right there. There you go. Port. 
All right, you have been spliced. It is now time to take a look at our creations and see what happens. And just to make sure that the Pikachu actually evolves, I'm going to grab some of these. I'm going to place them here and I'm going to set the Pikachu to, um, to be the target here. There you go. So that's going to be it. And then we're going to see what an actual evolution for Pikachu would be. We have a version of a Caterpie right here. We have two little Caterpies over there. Oh my God. There's a freaking Pikachu right there in the middle of the Caterpies. What the crap? Don't you dare have babies with Caterpies, all right? Stick to your own. Go back to freaking Pikachu land or whatever. Oh my God, there's so many Pikachus everywhere. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I can't believe they, they evolved so quickly, man. Look at that. They're doing so great. Population is amazing. The temperature is great. Everyone's happy here, man. We have all the different, all these different Pokemon here. And over here, we have, we should have some Diglets somewhere over here. Do we have Diglets? I don't see Diglets anywhere. Although Diglets are kind of hard to, to spot because, oh my God, there they are. I guess these, these are Diglets, right? These should be Diglets. Let's splice these guys with Diglet DNA. There you go. All right, now it's just a matter of time. We just have to wait and see what happens with these guys. Let's evolve them in unholy ways. You are my creation and you are perfect in every single way. All right, don't let anyone tell you otherwise. My God. All right, so that's what a Caterpie evolution looks like. They just stand up. That's a Caterpie right there. What? I have the feeling that Caterpies and Pikachus are, you know, going at it. Caterpies and Pikachus. I never expected that to happen, but it seems like they're just happy to mingle here. Look at that. <laughs> they're just going at it. All right. I want these guys to be pure Pikachus. All right. Just pure, pure Pikachus. And over here, we have some Caterpies. We have some Diglets right there. These definitely have Diglet DNA. The only problem is that they're not standing up uh, like upright. That's the only issue that I see there. But other than that, it seems like they're everyone here is doing OK, I feel like. Right. All right. So population is going down rapidly. I feel like maybe the Caterpies are just eating so much freaking food, man. They're eating so much food. It's just impossible for any other creature to survive. And that is a <laughs> that is a diglet right there. Is that a tiny little diglet? Caterpies have no shame. That is an ugly diglet right there. <laughs> Let's go over here. How are the Pikachus doing? So these, these Pikachus seem to be retaining some of their features, right? Some of them lost their tails. I think most of them are okay. What happens if you hit Pikachu with large amounts of radiation? Have you ever asked yourself that? Well, that's what we're gonna do right here. We're just gonna apply so much radiation that this is gonna be, it's gonna be painful to watch. We still have these guys over here though, and that's good. So I'm gonna reduce the land fertility just a tiny bit, just to make sure that uh, we have space for more population, for new individuals, for new specimens in here. All right, so in addition to applying just large, unholy amounts of radiation to these four little Pokemon here, I have also changed the landscape. That's right, it's getting a lot colder here. And I'm just trying to see what these guys are trying to do to adapt. Uh, these are supposed to be, I'm pretty sure these should be Caterpies. Uh, hello, sir. You do not look like a freaking Pikachu right there. It seems like the Caterpie features overshadow the Diglett features because I don't see many Diglets around here. So that's gonna be tough. Now in terms of the Pikachus that I'm trying to evolve here in the nursery, they don't seem to be very similar to a Pikachu. It seems like Raichu is definitely not as depicted in the, in the anime. Does this look like a freaking Raichu to you guys? Because I don't think so, right? Oh, they're getting bigger, dude. I'm gonna reduce the radiation here because they're getting way too big. Caterpies are now developing legs. <laughs> All right. I don't think these guys are gonna become butterflies eventually. I don't think it's gonna happen. I'm gonna keep, keep just hitting them with that Caterpie DNA. There you go. Bam. All right. So it's been generations and some of the Caterpies mixed with the freaking Pikachus. They developed a weird head, and now they're moving towards the water. Look at this little guy. What the f*** are you looking at? So happy in the water. 
They want to become water Pokemon, it seems like. Let me heal some of these guys right there. I mean, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Does that look like a Caterpie evolution to you? Of course not. Of course not. But this is what Caterpies would actually look like if they followed biology rules, you know, realistic evolution rules. And that's a diglet right there. <laughs> Those are diglets, my god, that's that's awful, dude. All right, so here we have the Pikachus. Having little Pikachus and multiplying. <laughs> so here's what I'm gonna do. Do you see this radiation symbol right here? I'm just gonna... <clears throat> just, just hit him with that radiation. Chernobyl is gonna be a joke compared to what's gonna happen to these creatures right here. Oh my god. <laughs> They're growing freaking horns. What? They're growing horns. No, 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 dude. Oh my god, what the crap is that? What is this? What was that? Look at that. Oh my god. <laughs> what is this thing? Is that a Pokemon? Is that the actual Pikachu evolution? <laughs> we have other Pikachus over here. I wonder how, how do these look like? Oh boy. Oh boy, these do not look like something I want to have in my house, dude. Let's imagine I'm a, I'm a beginner Pokemon trainer, right? I'm given three choices. <laughs> I can choose this guy over here. <laughs> I can choose, where's the freaking dude with the horns? The red one, I think it's dead. Oh, I can choose this guy over here. I can choose the Pikachu. I can choose the Diglett with, with the ugliest face in the world, which is somewhere over here. Or I can choose these weird <laughs> Caterpies. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna go with a red dude, all right? I would go with this red dude over here, which just died. Let's save him. There you go, there he is. I would go with this dude. He looks so freaking lit, guys. All right, so it seems like this is the latest Caterpie evolution. <laughs> we have two different types here. Let's take a look at the clay diagram here real quick. So we have a... They definitely branched out into multiple different creatures. Look at this one. This one was perfect, dude. That was a perfect Pikachu right there. What happened, man? This That's a Caterpie evolution. That's another Caterpie evolution. That's a mix of Caterpie and Pikachu. Look at this one. This one's okay. That's a weird... That's a weird one. Oh, man. Oh, my God. This was so cool. Look at this one. All right. These Pikachu seem to be doing okay here. All right, they have the basic shape down, they have the tail, they have the weird head, and that's the surprise Pikachu head. Look at that! That's a perfect surprised Pikachu face right there. And some of them are headed into the water. It seems like they're in too much pain, you know? Real evolution is kind of painful. Is this the Pokemon world you guys imagined? You thought reality was an anime voice? No. This is reality right here. Some of you guys were scared of the Pikachu in the Detective Pikachu trailer because it looked too realistic. What do you think of it now, huh? What do you think of it now? It's dead. <laughs> just died. I mean, Pikachus and Diglets just had babies. You really don't want to see what real Pokemon behavior is. Have you guys ever seen a Pikachu swim? Look at it right there. That's Pikachu right there, just, just relaxing, just a nice Sunday. I mean, you would think that a Pikachu would stay away from the water, given, you know, the fact that it's a Pikachu, but nope. Not at all. They love swimming, dude. According to real evolution, at least. Look at it! It's kinda cute, come on! Don't tell me this isn't kinda cute. It is definitely kinda cute, look at it. Look at it! Look at the Pikachus! Just walking around, look at them. Walking around, waddling around moving their tails. Come on, this is kind of cute. This is a mix between a Caterpie and a Pikachu. It can happen. All right, guys, you definitely don't want to know what happens to Pokemon when they evolve. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what the crap, dude? Look at this. This is the Pikachu. Look at those legs. Look at the thighs. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, dude, that's not that's not what you want to see my dude. Well, we have transformed Pikachu 
into an awful creature. <laughs> Look at that thing. Oh no, 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 no. What's going on here? Come on. Come on. All right, so I'm applying crazy amounts of radiation to these Pikachus right here in hopes of evolving them in weird, unexpected ways. And they're getting bigger, dude. All right, that's not a Pokemon anymore. That's not even close to a freaking Pikachu, man. Let's burn this. 70 degrees. Die. Die. All right, boys. So that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.